So, tell us a little interesting fact about yourself, Scott. Don't call But myself would be... I'm not sure if I still hold the record, but I was the youngest ever player to play in the SPL when I made my debut. I think I was 16 in one month or so. Can you tell me an interesting fact about yourself, Dills? No, not really. Uh, interesting fact, um, played in more countries than you've had clubs, to be fair. <laughs> I think I've played in uh, five different countries now professionally. Stuck them all out, which is not great. <laughs> no, but um, yeah, five countries, so. Hi, mad oh, luck. Hey, top of my. Just... Don't know, if it's me or your brother would know more stories about him. Yeah, when we. So, what was it now? Maybe. You... When did you come into the. You were about 12 when you first started playing for the first team, weren't you? 16, 17. Right, so, I would have been about 8. Yeah, so 12, 13 years now, isn't it? Yeah. But yeah, mad flat. I was number 74. 72, I was. No, some amount of players. So many players were down. Right. That's probably a problem, by the way, administration as well. So your wages were a problem, you were <laughs> into administration, but they are. <laughs> no, but yeah, so that's two clubs now. Play four together. Yeah, that's it, my man. Hopefully, me promotion here. Get a club back up where it belongs. Right, Dows. Would you rather be able to talk to land animals, animals that fly, or animals that live under the water? Um, uh, I'll, I'll go land animals. More contact with them. I can't talk underwater, so what's the point in talking to them? Right, no worries. Neighbours are home, or, home and away. <laughs> Neighbours. Oh, you Ramsey Street number. Birds are better in the way, but... Would you rather have a flying carpet or a car that can go underwater? Uh, a flying carpet. There's a lot underwater, there's an underwater theme here, isn't there? Aye, flying I'm carpet for me. Right, that's us. Is that the question? <laughs> <laughs> Get you your training in second. Take you, away you, the car you, school. <laughs> you, you, you've that's the... Get the lads on the carpet. <laughs> Yeah, the, the car under the water is a non-starter, I think. The, the flying carpet at least gets me out of the traffic, travelling to and from Edinburgh, you know? And if we, uh, if we can get a car school going eventually, once uh, everything's settled down, I can get all the lads on the... get we Rob on the carpet with me, huh? <laughs> me and you on a rug. Come on. <laughs> so you got cup holders? <laughs> right, yeah, we can come on. Yeah, we cup holder. Sorry. We velvet rug. <laughs> Ooh. You ready? If you could be another Scott Robertson for a day, the neighbour's character or the member of the band Fight. Fight. All day long. Give us a give, 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 give songs. Uh, <laughs> nah, Stocksy can no, he sung one for his initiation. What did he say? Five, keep on moving. So you can give us a song. Um, <laughs> salt and sauce or salt and vinegar on chips. I know you're a healthy man. Salt and sauce place. all day long. That's a... That's an Edinburgh thing, isn't it? Glasgow like salt and vinegar. There. Would you rather lose the ability to read or lose the ability to speak? Read. <laughs> Would you rather be able to speak any language in the world or be the funniest person on the whole planet? Speak any language. No, you're not bothered about other people, are you? No. You're a lone wolf. Yeah, that's it. That's uh, just yeah. double checking. To yeah, can't yeah. read anymore. <laughs> I've lost the ability to read. I was like, so next one is who would win in a fight between the two of you? <laughs> so remember, I'm nails as well. I think we fight. We bought everyone else so. to, in, to in the, the team. Yeah. Well, we've oh, had, we've had, Sam. we've had this discussion as a as a team briefly, and uh, my vote was for Robo. So. Um, King of the Ring. Yeah, and King of the Ring. But as, as a, as a tag team, as a, as a Dudley brother tag team, I think we'd, have, we'd take a lot of them. Aye, aye. Get the table. Aye. Yeah, you'd maybe have to worry about Muzz a little bit. He'd just run around headroom people, I think. But <laughs> um, Big Sam, some size. Yeah, I, I need a set of leather to get near him. I'm straight after Danny Armstrong. <laughs> I'm just <laughs> <laughs> beelining for him, I think. But, um, 
but yeah, I think the two of us, we if it came down to it, we rob it. Though. He'd have me. You don't even answer that as well. Like you could have been like, nah. I don't know. See, we've been the same. Nah, but straight away at the end, there you were just like, nah, I'm out. <laughs> which which McGowan brother is the most handsome, Dylan or Ryan? No, oh, definitely Dills. His brother's too hairy. Don't know whether to talk to him or clap him. <laughs> Far too hairy. <laughs> I knew you were going to say that. The, the hairiest hands in world football, to be fair to him. Uh, he needs a good watch. Like Michael Jackson, just as he's about to turn into <laughs> Thriller Man. <laughs> just leave. <laughs> I swear that. If you could meet your real life hero, who would it be and why? So you can decide who wants to answer first on that one. I've got one. Okay. Henrik. Aye, uh, King Henrik. Henrik Larson for me. King Henrik. <laughs> <laughs> just admire them for when I was a wee boy, so I just loved everything he'd done. What a striker, what a player. Probably one of the greatest to play in Scotland as well, so be him at Larson for me. Um, I'd probably go a little, bit, a little bit bigger than that. Maybe like Muhammad Ali or something. I think uh, he's got a bit about him. Plus I'd do him an all, King of the Ring. <laughs> <laughs> right boys, you've got to know each other even better than you already did over the years. So you're going to be good teammates this season? Aye, definitely. Keep scoring goals, get me up. <laughs>